Let him off, Sky. Let him off. Yeah, you put this in my pocket. You have to plug your. Uh, oh, it's my charger come out. There okay. you go. I didn't plug it in, did I? Not sure if that's charging. Anyway, uh, good, after, good afternoon everybody and uh, welcome to uh, Martin from South Yorkshire Ghost Hunters uh, this afternoon. Uh, just taking that afternoon uh, walk, uh, hike uh, with, my, uh, with my daughter uh, Sky and uh, uh, my dog. So uh, we're at the side of the uh, M1 motorway. Uh, just going for the going for a walk in the, our local woods. Now the path that we're on here uh, is uh, supposed to be uh, quite haunted. I've done a couple of investigations here in the past, and it's supposed to be uh, uh, <coughs> reported by walkers that uh, it's supposed to be haunted with uh, a black witch. Not is in uh, uh, a, a, the colour of clothing, uh, a black witch that is supposed to be reported floating along this path when dog walkers have, uh, have walked down here, and it is uh, supposed to have petrified uh, many uh, many dog walkers. So, uh, not been down this uh, this route for a long time. So. I thought uh, I'd come and uh, have a walk this afternoon here and uh, it's not more, it's not of a, of a ghost hunt, that's, that's not what I'm doing it's more or less because uh, I've been stuck in for a few weeks and uh, the weather is uh, nice today all the snow's uh, gone uh, just about and uh, I just needed to get out and uh, go for a walk so uh, that's what I'm doing uh, right now anyway uh, we'll be taking some pictures as well later on and uh, posting them on the uh, on the page here <laughs> So uh, oh, I've got an heavy pack pack on uh, on my back as well with some uh, cameras in and other stuff. There's a dog coming in the sky with a walker. So hopefully uh, I've heard a rumor that uh, they may be lifting some uh, uh, sanctions soon with regards to uh, the uh, coronavirus and uh, we may be, uh, be able to uh, meet up with uh, six other people outside uh, so that's going to be good so hopefully we'll be able to do uh, some form of, uh, of ghost hunting uh, again with some of our members from our group so just just waiting on the information I've not been ghost hunting uh, myself uh, since uh, January uh, because of uh, the lockdown uh, rules that's been put on us. So hopefully uh, when some changes come that uh, we'll be able to uh, to go out again because I really miss going out ghost hunting and urban exploring and uh, meeting up with uh, uh, our team so I, I put the leash on him because we're coming to come here because we're coming near the edge of the motorway
That leads down to uh, some stables down there. So we're not, we're not going to go that way. Uh, so we're going to uh, in here. So there's the uh, M1 motorway. A couple of weeks ago, uh, before we got the snow, I was on the opposite side uh, when I took you down to uh, a lagoon. The blue lagoon, as I've named it, because the water turn, uh, turn, turns blue in the uh, in the summer with the sun. No, I'd keep him on his lead until we get further into the uh, into the woods. So I haven't been down this far uh, into the woods for uh, quite a number of years. My son's always down here because they build uh, what you call jumps and uh, they come down with their uh, bikes, uh, mountain bikes and uh, and create uh, uh, jumps. Hello uh, Joseph, hope, you hope you're well buddy. I've not heard you from uh, Anselo for a while. Just you keeping well and the family. It's a bit murky that water isn't it? I don't think it's a pond, I think it's just a uh, with all the weather we've had, then it's created that uh, big puddle. <clears throat> anyway, if you uh, if you carry on walking down, uh, uh, this path for about three miles, it fetches you to uh, uh, a place called uh, Rockley Engine House. We're not going to go down that far, because uh, I've got to uh, be back home for at least 4 p.m. I've got to, I've got to go to Mineral or Meadow, Meadow Hill, as what people, some people call it, and uh, I've got to go for uh, uh, the opticians. Oh, what was that then? I think that was a, a grey squirrel. Yeah, so uh, you can see that grey squirrel. We got the tree, I don't think we can. It's run up right up now. Anyway, uh, like I said, we're hoping to be uh, back out doing his uh, ghost hunts uh, very soon. If you're interested in the paranormal, uh, we are looking for uh, new members to come uh, and join us. We are based at the uh, the Mecca Bingo uh, in Rotherham, and uh, we meet up every uh, Tuesday evening at 6:30 till 10 p.m. So uh, come and pay us a visit. Uh, your first visit is uh, is free uh, to come along and just to check us out, see how we are. And then uh, it's three pound fifty after that. If you wanna, if you wish to come back, and uh, after four weeks, if uh, uh, you carry on coming, uh, uh, and if you wanna become a member, uh, that's fine. And uh, hopefully after lockdown is finished. Uh, we've got an event at the uh, National uh, Services uh, Services Emergency Museum in Sheffield. I don't know why they ever changed the name. So I, uh, I prefer the old name of the uh, Sheffield Fire and Police Museum. So we're going there in July. Twice now we've uh, 
<coughs> had to uh, cancel uh, the, uh, the event because of the uh, coronavirus. So hopefully we might get there this year. Hopefully. Uh, let's see what uh, what happens with uh, with regards to that. So uh, we're trying to build up some more members so we can uh, hire these locations to. Uh, That's right, I've got you. Uh, hey. That's right, I've got you. Oh yeah, to do more ghost stunts at uh, buildings we hire. We do go out every Saturday evening uh, to uh, abandoned buildings and uh, also uh, uh, locations like this or, uh, or follies or castles. <coughs> oh, it's quite warm actually. I shouldn't have put this uh, big coat on. Yes, we're good, uh, Joseph. Not doing too bad. Just getting a bit bored now. Uh, being, uh, whoops, being sat at home and not really doing anything with myself. Starting to pull my hair out a little bit. Uh, so uh, I'm not sure. Are you still in lockdown in uh, Ireland? Uh, I think you still are, aren't you? Now, do you come out of a lockdown end of this month? Uh, you have to uh, have to let me know on your on your post. But uh, uh, we hopefully after the twenty second will be uh, coming out of uh, of lockdown. It's very muddy here. And uh, very, uh, very slippy. So, just trying to uh, watch where I'm walking here. The house has come up and down here as well uh, through the uh, through the woods. Not to come across any yet. So, uh, gonna walk for another probably mile or two, and then uh, me and uh, daughter will uh, stop for a bit of lunch uh, we're gonna have a we've got a tuna salad uh, in my backpack here so uh, we're gonna have that and uh, we carry on with uh, with our walk but I've got to be back for four and then get ready to go to Midderall. I've not been to Midderall oh for a long time and a bit weary actually of, uh, of going there uh, so uh, I'm not sure what to expect when I get there uh, uh, I don't know if it's gonna be uh, well I can't see many shops okay I lost the uh, signal then yeah level 5 uh, Joseph, wow! Uh, over here, the uh, the R level is uh, is dropping down, so uh, keep on uh, losing signal. So uh, if it carries on, I may have to uh, start recording off my uh, my other my other camera here, and uh, and then post the uh, the video afterwards uh, for everybody to uh, to watch.
So, so where's uh, where's jumps? Yeah, where the uh, Over there. hey, either right there. I'll find the way around this bit. It's a bit swampy down here. Now this is flooded, isn't it? With the uh, with the weather. It's like it's turning into a, a swamp. Look, is that ice still on top? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. Just to see if, that, if that's ice. We'd have thought it would have all melted now. All the uh, all the ice. It must have been really thick ice. Don't slip in it. Oh God, just be careful. Don't walk on top of it. Yeah, it's ice there. Uh, would have thought that uh, all the ice would have uh, melted away. It's quite warm actually uh, today. Come on then. Ah, this is the uh, this is the huts my son tells me about, where all the uh, the guys come down uh, and hang around in the summer, uh, building their j uh, jumps. So uh, let's just uh, take a look here of uh, these great big jumps. Is the footpath where? Oh, is there? Okay, let me follow the path. So this is where my uh, uh, my son comes down during the summertime, and the uh, the old build these uh, big jumps uh, for the mountain bikes. So you can see one there. Let me know. Uh, you've uh, probably got to go fast to get over that one. So it's a great big uh, uh, what do you call it that they built? Built like a uh, tree house over there. Uh, yeah. The, Still very icy, don't put the dog too close to the water. So this is where uh, the lads in my village come to in the summertime and uh, <clears throat> I build ramps and uh, have competitions and that with, e with each other. So uh, they must have covered it up to stop the clay from uh, uh, getting wet through. Well, <clears throat> my phone died, everybody, and uh, now I've uh, having to uh, use my uh, my camera. I had a funny feeling it was going to go. So uh, yeah, this is uh, the jumps that they uh, they come to, and uh, during the summertime and uh, build the uh, big, uh, big ramps here, big jumps and uh, with, the, uh, with the mountain bikes so uh, yeah quite interesting right shall we go back over that way sky the way the way we uh, we came in shall we go back over the way that we just come in so I don't want to uh, <coughs> fall down on this uh, on this clay. <coughs> Is it? Yeah. Now let me try. If I don't fall down. It's okay. Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's quite thick, isn't it? Yeah, I'm a bit. Coming off across it. Yeah, don't fall down. So I can see you, uh, you're as bad as me. You'll end up falling down. It's quite big, that ice. It's 
somebody's walking up here. Oh, it smells. This guy, do you want an old dog? Uh, I need to take care, uh, put my phone away. I've got of pets of you, you know. You've got quite good in person with baseball. Yeah. Have you? Yeah, that's right. We can do a bit later. When we stop for, uh, for a bit of, uh, of dinner. And uh, you can show me. Hold your phone, please. Hold my phone. Well, I'm going to just put it in, uh, in my pocket. Can you press me up in my pocket? I can use the power bank. Well, you can't. I can't. Bank. How are you going to charge phones up? You just put it, put it in my pocket, put your phone in my pocket. Like yeah. charges. Don't drop it. Don't drop it. And don't add towards any uh, Puddle. water puddles. With my phone, you know, I probably would wind that up around the phone, other way. Yep. So uh, there you go. They're the uh, they're the jumps uh, for the what the uh, BMXers and the mountain bikers come down and uh, 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 come down uh, during the summertime. My lad, uh, like I said, he, uh, he comes down here and. Uh, uses the jumps as well Is what? This leads all the way down to wreck in there. Right, what wreck? Cutting fork. Is it? Yeah. So it comes out at wreck? Yeah. Oh, right. Well, I thought it came <laughs> out uh, at. Uh, what do you call it? If you walk all the way around. Yeah. Yeah, but we're not. We're going to carry straight on. What? We're going to carry straight on. Don't fall down here. Did you this go up? Yeah. Do you what a church? Not with church. Won't we? Okay. Be best to uh, <laughs> pick another path. I've got a funny feeling I'm going to end up going over, uh, falling straight over, and landing in the mud. I really do. 
because uh, I do end up doing things like that. looking at something here somebody posted on one of uh, our local group posts about uh, a brick wall with arches in I don't think this is it uh, I know of that I can see of I don't think it is but uh, I've never come across those uh, those arches myself so I thought this might have been it here. It's just a, a normal uh, uh, brick wall. Farmers fields being planted, uh, ploughed. Sorry, it looks like uh, ready for uh, for planting. So I wonder what's going in there. Most of uh, uh, things that uh, are planted around here is more more like rapeseed oil uh, that uh, has grown quite a lot uh, up this part of the. Uh, of the country so that's what probably possibly that uh, may be uh, but I uh, wonder how it's going to uh, take especially with uh, yeah it was uh, with the uh, with the weather uh, that uh, uh, we've had So I'm uh, going to stop soon, uh, in another 10 minutes, and uh, have a break, and uh, a cup of tea. So I'm hoping that, that uh, we can uh, uh, soon uh, start travelling a little bit further and uh, hopefully uh, me and my daughter will uh, uh, go find uh, some, some other little uh, spots that uh, we, can, uh, we can visit. Anyway, another thing, uh, we, we needed some help, uh, everybody. Uh, we, uh, as most of you know, uh, well, most, some of you will be watching this video from YouTube. Uh, anyway, uh, and apart from the first bit that was done on, uh, on Facebook. Uh, but uh, uh, could you help us by liking and, and, and subscribing to, to his YouTube channel? Uh, we are trying to get uh, over a thousand uh, subscribers. I think we're coming up. I think we're at 490 at the moment. But we really need your help, uh, and we would appreciate it if you would like and subscribe and uh, and and uh, join the page. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I don't think we can get through there, can we? Yeah, you can walk round. You can walk round from Cross Road. Yep. You can either go up um, that way, and you go back way. Oh, yeah. Or you can carry on and take you out the break that way. Oh, yeah. See that horse there Yeah. That's basically not failing. Is, is this uh, thing is? Uh, no, this is Barley Hall. Oh, is this Barley Hall? Mm. Have you been here before then? No. I just feel like these people move. Oh. Yeah. So why do you know not horses' names then? So they used to do that, that one. Oh, they used to put you over stables? Yeah. My, uh, my daughter Sky, she works at the uh, local stables. In the uh, in the village, so uh, she's telling me the uh, the horses' names. So we're going through sludgy mud paths uh, again. See some of the the horses have been riding down here as well. Barley Hall, that's uh, Harley, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was. Uh, uh, I've uh, see where we are. I'm, I've not been down as far as this before, but I thought you could get through the field. At one stage, you could get through the field and carry on walking down the side of the motorway. Uh, years ago, and this is why it's all sloppy and sludgy, is because uh, with the horses, uh, they uh, their droppings like there, uh, it gets mushed up into uh, into the ground. I'm not sure if I've been down here before. I think I have actually. Me and, uh, yeah, I have. Uh, me and, uh, what's his name? Next door but one? Callum. Callum, that's it. Years ago, I, uh, when he was a young lad, he wanted to go bike riding. My kids were too young then. And I said, I'll take your bike riding because I had, uh, used to have a, a mountain bike. Uh, and uh, what I call it, uh, I said I'll take your bike riding or plummet now. I've not, I'd not been biking for a couple of years and uh, I was all right going downhill but when I was climbing the hill into Wentworth uh, <coughs> going up to uh, the uh, uh, Wentworth uh, garden centre I couldn't get up that hill I was seeing stars <laughs> Anyway, we came down this way, yeah, I remember now, and uh, anyway, when we got to uh, Top of Wentworth, we turned left and went to the pub, I can't remember what the pub's called now, in Wentworth, and uh, I can't remember, I can't remember what it's called, anyway, we stopped there, and uh, I bought uh, Callum dinner, red lunch, and I had a great big mixed grill, uh, with, uh, well I can't remember what's on it, but it was a big mixed grill and I had two pints of, uh, of Shandy and uh, anyway there's a big garden outside and uh, we, uh, I said to come, so let's sit on here for a bit and, uh, and uh, what do you call it, just uh, admired the scenery and uh, so on, I fell asleep for two hours believe it or not he was only about 10 years old, poor lad, Callum, at that time. And uh, he left me for two hours of sleep. Anyway, he, he finally did wake me up, uh, falling asleep for two hours. And uh, he says, uh, you've been asleep for two hours. 
I said, why didn't you blooming wake me? So, uh, <coughs> what had happened is uh, because uh, <coughs> of the uh, of the cycling that I did, trying to get uphill, it, it knackered me out. It really did. So, <coughs> I've never really been back on the mountain bike after that. Uh, I gave it up. I gave the, the bike to my lad uh, a few years ago. And uh, he destroyed it like he does with his bikes. And... Uh, what I call it. Uh, so he got a bit of pleasure out of the uh, of the mountain bike uh, that he had of mine. But uh, yeah, I fell asleep and was asleep for two hours. Laid on the on the lawn at the pub, and uh, he he, uh, he got me up two hours later and said, "I want to go home." Anyway, I says, uh, "What do you mean you want to go home? We've only just got here." And he says, "Yeah, yeah, and uh, oh, you've been asleep for two hours, and I wish I did." I, I couldn't believe it that I, I slept uh, for blooming two hours. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, it was a lovely day that day, nice and warm. And uh, it was uh, quite tranquil uh, with the uh, with birds singing and all the other stuff. Anyway, yeah. We've, uh, we've just about done a full circle here. Yeah? We're uh, just dropping down into Harley. Right, right up there and then through the woods. Yep. Okay. So what we'll do, we'll go up there through those woods. No, uh, you, you get stuff there. And then we'll, uh, what I call it, we hopefully we'll stop for some some dinner. So uh, I've got about three minutes, four minutes left of uh, of this film to do. And uh, <clears throat> I'll uh, catch you uh, after after lunch. I'm having uh, we're having tuna sa tuna with salad, a uh, couple of uh, hard boiled eggs. So I've got that in the backpack here. So that's what we're having. I've got, I had to eat a lot of salad myself because I'm I'm diabetic, and my over the last few years my sugar levels have, have been hard to get down so I've got them back down now to uh, normal levels which is uh, over the last four days has been about four between four and four point four so I'm really good and uh, I'm not tired as, as much anymore and I'm not waking up through the night as well I do. Gosh, just don't you just hate that when uh, you you you're polite to somebody and you say yeah hello to them. I uh, I always try to uh, be polite and and say hello to people when uh, when I'm walking past them. But uh, but I mean what to call it. Uh, Ignorant, it really is. Uh, she like eh? She like kids sick. What? I can't really see it myself. Oops. You can whisper it, me. That's it. You got me an that's it. Yeah. You throw rocks in it, and then he went, and that's what you throw it, and then he said that word. Oh, you threw that's what you throw at Nazis. Yeah, that's what he said. Let yeah. me know what's his there. Uh, What's his family teaching him? He only looked about five. Yep, we'll do. Uh, we'll do that. What about walking on? That'll fetch you to uh, stables, won't it? Yeah, it's a dead end. What dandy's a dead end? Yeah. Yeah. All right, then we'll uh, we'll walk this way. So, uh, yeah, the little kid uh, drawing stones, he only looked about five, six, and say Nazis, Nazis. <laughs> Blooming hell, fire. Uh, I wonder what they're teaching him in his household. Really would like to know. <laughs> uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah, it wasn't very... Uh, 
Yeah, it's one thing I hate is, is when you're walking somewhere, like most walkers do, they'll, they'll pass each other and you'll say good day or good morning or good evening to each other and then you get people like that that uh, are just totally ignorant. You know that woman who was so unfair? Yeah. Yeah. Ah oh dear. That's a nice sauce, isn't it? Nice chocolate brown horse. Anyway, this uh, this video is going to run out uh, in a moment, and uh, I'm getting a bit tired now walking up this this bit of a hill. So uh, it's about a minute left. Do you know why can't people take the uh, dirty mass home with them and uh, and dispose of them properly? Really. Uh, Hi everybody, I'm back again. We, uh, what I call it, uh, we walked about another mile and uh, then we had lunch and then uh, we headed off back. We was uh, going out near Wentworth. We're back at the, uh, what I call it now, jumps and uh, heading back uh, back home. So uh, we're gonna jump in the car when we get to the uh, end of the woods here and uh, head off uh, uh, back home uh, my ankles are killing me especially with walking in this uh, this mud uh, which is done uh, by the horses here it's very hard to walk in it and uh, searching my oops searching my ankles uh, uh, quite a bit now which I do suffer with my uh, with my ankles so yep uh, anyway uh, thanks for uh, watching the uh, the video and uh, sorry that uh, we've not got no videos out for quite a while uh, over uh, doing a paranormal uh, but uh, due to uh, the uh, coronavirus so uh, we've not been able to uh, how many steps have we done? How many steps have we done? 7,000. 7,000? It's going up, how we're walking. Well, we've done seven, over 7,000 steps. So, uh, that's good. Oh, dear. Uh, I think the most of that I've done in the day is just over 10,000 steps for me. So how many steps did you do? Uh, about six. Yeah. Ten. Uh, for me it was 6,000 uh, but I pushed myself once and did 10,000 steps oh gosh that did kill me doing that uh, my ankles were, were bad for a few days so I'm gonna get home put some uh, uh, ibuprofen cream on me uh, on my legs so we're back at that pond bit there uh, again so uh, yeah, as soon as uh, uh, restrictions are lifted, we uh, will hopefully be out uh, doing uh, doing this ghost hunting again for you to watch over on uh, on YouTube. So there you go. We've got to get home, we've got to bath the dog as well because uh, he's filthy uh, so he'll need a he'll need a bath
must be slowing down. My daughter's going ahead in front of me. My shoulder, uh, my uh, rucksack's falling, falling off. There's another pond there with the uh, that's uh, frozen up with uh, with all the water. It's over there. And I don't think we're too far away now uh, from the uh, from the car. Hopefully, we might be going out again tomorrow. Me and uh, me and Sky. Uh, we're not sure yet. We're thinking about doing a cooking video uh, out uh, in uh, in our woods. So uh, we'll see how that goes tomorrow, and uh, we may do some uh, some cooking. while we're in the woods so may prepare everything here uh, and then uh, take it with us and uh, and uh, what to call it uh, do some cooking while we're out tomorrow oh dear I feel like resting Oh yeah. The worst thing about it is is these boots uh, that I wear. Uh, these wellies. Working well, in Australia, gum boots. Uh, <coughs> they're they're quite heavy uh, because the steel toe capped and uh, the bottom of them are really thick rubber and. Uh, to protect uh, the industrial uh, uh, wellies. The, 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 uh, the thing about them, they're, they're thermal. So uh, I've got a pair of thermal socks on as well, but the lining of inside is fur and uh, double uh, coated inside, and uh, your feet do sweat in them. They, uh, they, they do get you do your feet do get hot even in the middle of winter. Uh, they're uh, really good, but the problem is they're they're heavy. Oh yeah, what is it? Yeah, that's all right, isn't it? So uh, yeah, that's the only problem with them. They're heavy. It's like where. Uh, probably uh, like walking on the moon with the uh, the weight to hold you down. <laughs> anyway, back to the side of the uh, M1 motorway again. Yeah, that's where we uh, probably might go tomorrow. So we do some cooking. Yeah. Yeah, could have a could have a fire. Okay, uh, what is uh, some kids here? Just turn the uh, the camera. Sky, what's that? Farmers Field. Farmers Field. Where is it? Farmers. Uh, is it? So, uh, might have been easier to walk on this guy than actually walking on uh, on this. So that's the woods that I was in last week, well, a couple of weeks ago, over there, uh, when I did the, the, uh, the live feed. And uh, just over there is the, uh, uh, 
the Blue Lagoon. <coughs> oh. Oh, there's people walking on there, so I bet you can walk on there. I wonder what's at the... Uh... What time is it now, Sky? Um, 20 past. 20 past three? Yeah. Oh, best hurry up and get home. Yeah, just post them on Facebook. Uh, so yeah, people have been walking over there. I'd like to know what's the top of that bit. That's those people walk, walk past us, isn't it? At uh, Wentworth. That old couple. I wonder if they're going to quick away then. Yeah, oh, it's kennels, not stables. I called them kennels earlier on, but they're not. It's, uh, it's stables. Uh, kennels, not stables. I will get it right. Oh, my ankles are throbbing. I need some I have a real friend rubbing on my feet. Makes it worse with this mud because you're sliding on it. Uh, Sky, let's try and uh, get off this bit of path because uh, it's put a lot of pressure on my ankles. Now let's uh, let's walk on this bit. It's a bit more uh, a bit more better. Not much better, but. People walking around. Oh, dear. It is, isn't it? I don't know what they use it for. Oh, we're coming back to a normal concrete path now. Thank God. At least we're not going to be slipping and sliding and, and other stuff. So yeah, there are kennels there, that's the uh, pet where to keep dogs there, kennels. 
Where's that white building I've just seen? Where's that white building I've just seen? Is it, what is it? Oh, it's there. I'm just wondering, man. So it looks a bit closer. <coughs> God, everybody's walking the dogs. Like I said, uh, uh, it was once reported uh, uh, before that uh, people who uh, was walked down here have reported seeing a, uh, a figure of a of a black witch, a witch dressed in all black, floating in the uh, in the air. Hello. I don't. Yeah. Hey, it's being polite. Uh, you say hello back to people when yeah. somebody when somebody says hello to you. It's uh, it's good nature to uh, to reply. I really enjoy that woman. Yeah, or that man. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I've got a person the other day, so I can't get broken into. Hey? I've got a person the other night, so I can't get broken into yet. Oh, yeah. Never ever have a rake and thing, but they're first by a gym bag. Oh, yeah. Gosh, she still feels like we've got a long way to walk till we uh, get to the uh, end of the path here. Oh, I can see the uh, the road. Must be a good half a mile, three quarters of a mile away. Be glad to uh, sit down and have another quick cup of tea at the car, and just to uh, lift my legs up off the uh, off the floor. Tree there. How strange that trees grow. Ooh. Yeah, when I've uh, been in here before in the past and, and in the ghost hunt, uh, uh, we've gone in this first part of the woods here. I think last time I, I came here was with uh, Richard and Aaron and, uh, and Tim. That's got to be, I think, 2017-2018 that uh, we came in here and, uh, and did a ghost stunt. So it's been a while. He didn't answer it, did he? No, Oh, Sky, let's just stop a minute because my left foot is, uh, is starting to throb. That's what they use them for shooting. Hey? When, when people go shooting, yeah. they use them. Do they? Find this video boring. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 
I might not make it tomorrow with uh, with my ankles going for another walk. My hips starting to hurt as well. Gosh, it's no good being in your fifties. Uh, you start uh, feeling the uh, the aches and pains. I think the dog's a bit tired now. Saying that, he doesn't usually get tired. Twice, yeah. He walks uh, walks for miles. With, uh, with our sky. Oh, the houses are getting closer. So, uh, yeah, we're going to have to come back in here and do another ghost hunt uh, uh, when we can. So, like I said, it's ooh, a good three, four years. Gosh, those three, four years have gone really quick. Uh, since our last year. No, I think I did come after. I think it was me, Richard, Aaron and, and Pete that come. Yeah, it was. So I think that's about 2018, early 2019. myself anyway I'm just gonna let this uh, video run run its course now uh, it's, it'll be re running out in about two between two and three minutes uh, hopefully by the uh, time three minutes is up I would probably made it to the car uh, but I'm slowing down now uh, all the time as I'm walking You'll get a lot of walkers uh, coming down here. Uh, I mean, there's two. There's one. There's two on the field there. Uh, but uh, there's a lot of walkers that uh, that do come down here with the dogs. So, like I said about uh, people uh, reporting seeing this witch. I'm not sure how far down it was uh, that they uh, they saw it. Uh, on which part of the uh, of the woods it was uh, uh, along this path, but uh, that's uh, the rumours. I think there is some articles about it. I'll have to see if I can uh, find the article with uh, with regards to it. But uh, that's the uh, the talk of uh, uh, of this uh, location that. Uh, Dog walk to walkers have uh, reported seeing uh, <coughs> a, a, a figure of a, of a black uh, witch just in black. I'm not on about in colour uh, of cultural, but uh, of, of clothing. 